Hi guys, welcome back. Today I'm going to be experimenting a little bit with VTube Studio. Uh, VTuber Studio. I did this on the other Mac and I am learning how to do it with OBS to integrate the green screen is in one of the backgrounds in VTuber Studio with the little kitty. Um, this is one of the characters I chose because the kitty is the most expressive and works the best for my face for some reason. Um, there's, I did download another kitty cat that was optional. Somebody created on uh, the workshop. Unfortunately, the kitty is cute, but its lips don't work. And um, it's kind of like stupid. You know what? Like, really stupid? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It doesn't work. So I, I was like, okay, let's just try something with this. Because um, I'm not sure how this is going to work, but I figure we'll try it anyway. After all, can't be any worse than the other background picture. So we're just trying it with V2 Studio Lite. I'm not, um, with just the register program. I got the full program uh, from my Mac. And uh, it works. Um, the, I haven't figured out yet what else I can do with it. Um, don't worry, let me show you some of the other models that work. Um, I found the ones that came with the game, um, the program is the most useful. So I double click, as you can see, I'm already here. I'm going to change my model. Um, yeah, uh, let me just show you. For example, this one, kind of cool. Um, I'm not sure which one this one is. Um, copy set from a... Okay. Um, Tororo. Yeah, okay. All right, so now this is me as a uh, human type figure. Um, copy basic settings. Copy physics win settings. Just say. Copy everything. Copy primary setup, hotkeys, expression files. Um, wait. I don't know. Don't want to copy expression files. Copy anti art mesh setting. Okay. All right. It says, are you sure you want to copy selected parts of the model? No. Cancel. I don't want to. No. Can you? Just... Okay. There I am. Let me let me shrink me down a bit. Oh, well, basically, what it's supposed to do. Is um, is it supposed to let me create a character? And this is one I was playing with earlier, so I don't really know why it does that. But you can actually add models. So let's just pull this one up here, okay? Um, so here I have this little me, and um, I'm gonna make it a lot bigger <laughs> so I can see my face better. Um. And, um, so yeah, now you got me, I'm right here on the screen, you can see me out the background of Silver Moon, and, uh, the only thing is, I kind of wish there was a way I could, uh, do something different, like, that's better, more centered picture anyway, so I can add backgrounds, I can add, like, things like little ears and things like that to it, you know, but uh, you can add backgrounds. Like, I, okay, for example, like if I want to add backgrounds um, or foregrounds, so like I can go to um, uh, that's background. I want to change that. Um, let's see. Animated head pad. Oh. Beverage, cat ear, yellow, cat tail. Um, I don't really know if that's going to work for me. That's for my model. Okay, so 
What about a prop? Like a desk? A table? Yeah. Alright. Christmas presents. Automation. Christmas microphone. Lots of Christmas stuff. Table. Yeah, it's literally a table. Uh, I'm going to put it in front of me. Okay, so... Here's the thing. There's no legs on said table. Will you stop? I know what to do. Thank you. I've done this enough times. Oh, boy, you think. Okay. Now, um, so anyway, whoa, now it's locked together. Oh, that's weird. I saw that, actually, I saw a table like that. Um, one time some guy was coming up with that, or you could lock the table to the model. I don't want to lock it to the model. Because that's so stupid, it doesn't make any sense. Yes. No, 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 no. I don't... <laughs> I, want, I want the background to stay locked, not me. Oh, I did this again. How do I do that? Um, all right, so... Yeah, that's fine. The background I don't want locked. Oh, oh okay, I see it. Okay. Yeah. Oh, this is stupid. I want to lock the background. I always do want to have a table waving back and forth. That's so stupid. It doesn't make any sense. Um, so, yes. All right, so now we can see... <laughs> I still got my table waving around. Guys, this is stupid. What am I, 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 I doing with a table locked to me? I don't make any sense. It doesn't make any sense at all. No. No, we don't. Okay. pre select an item. Cancel that. Okay. So let's take this. Not me. Unlock everything. I don't want to unlock. I don't want to unlock me. Okay. Unlock the items. Perfect. Let's take this table and this is just the top anyway. That's better. Anyway, the point is, is that you can do that. It's kind of cute because it's like, well, it's kind of stupid too. It's like, what would you want to do with that? Why would you want to do that? Ah. Really? It doesn't make any sense. Why would you want to do that? So. So this program lets you do things like this. So uh, it's simple. Uh, you can get customized loadable characters and backgrounds and things like that. But for what I'm doing right now, the green screen background works fine because I can add it to my other characters. Just don't pick a model that has green. That's all. <laughs> so, um, yeah, it works. Also, if you have, and I do, have multiple cameras... I could have a guest set up a second instance of the same program. So I could have, say, like Krista could be off site here, and she can also be talking at the same time. How would that work? Well, uh, gets kind of interesting. Just to keep it simple, it gets interesting, but you could do it. You can have multiple people. If you have enough frame on the computer, that is, you can do that. You can have multiple 
sessions going. Well, uh, the point is, guys, this is a really interesting software program, but I really got to learn how to do it better than this. This is just like, so when you double click on this, you get the different icons. For example, it would be nice if it showed like collaborative, Steam Workshop. I won't put the details in this. Um, you can lock models, backgrounds. Don't want to change that. Please select the item. Oh. Okay, I get it. Create a new item scene. Okay. Remember that tail? I'm going to hit create. So, let's go. Okay, now that's something else. Wait a minute. Um, that's a different program. Shoot. Um, so I can add, what does this button do? Collab control scene. Oh. Okay. Um, so... Background items. I don't want to change that. That's working right now. The way it is. I don't want to change that. The items. Uh, okay. Link. Um, all right. Let's just see black sunglasses. Just the hell of it. This one makes sense, right? You want to add that to me. All right. So... Item order. Yours always start at zero. Okay. Oh, I see what it is. Yeah, in this case, it would make sense. Yes, I am going to pin my glasses to my item. So, don't show me this again. I already get it. I already get it. I don't need to see this again. All right. Towards my glasses. Oh, there they are. Holy crap, the little small. Oh, uh, that's a little bit too big. Oh, uh, okay. All right. All right. That makes sense to be pinned to me and my glasses. Whoa, they don't stay on too good, do they? Whoa. <laughs> uh, it's cute, but it, it's kind of stupid. So, just drag them to the trash. That's all. Let's just, I was just playing with it. So, anyway, I was going to use this one time. And then I never did. And then, um, so, I started looking at some of the VTuber stuff. And I was like, yeah, you know what? This would be quite cool. This would be kind of cool. Well, So if I ran two uh, instances of the program, I could have the bear in this screen, and I could have the little kitty cat. Like Krista could be the little kitty cat, or Krista could be the other woman. There are lots of other plugins um, for the thing to try. So, yeah, it's the whole idea. Yeah, it's kind of cool, but I don't really know if it's going to work. You see, get on the set. I don't know. Uh, it might work. My eyes don't open very good today. Are my eyesight really that bad? Yeah. Come on. Open your eyes and see the world, honey. Come on. That seems like, oh, you're not going to see your eye bus. Uh, oh, you know what I could do? Um, I could share... I'm oh, sorry, I'm tired. It's, I didn't get a lot of sleep last night. Anyway, so, um, I can go to settings. I can go to my model settings. Okay. Well, 
Or you can go to physics strength, wind strength, fixed weight lines, V2 studio model. Face right there, face. Uh, eyes open left. Sensitivity. I smile left. I open right. I open left. I smile right. I X. Oh, I'm not going to change these. I don't want to mess up the software. Just uh, idle animation, tracking lost. What does this do? Idle animation cancel. I'm not going to change that. Also, it's supposed to be, supposed to be a way to add emotions to this. I don't understand all this yet. But, uh, the thing I do understand is it's kind of cool, but it's really uh, kind of weird. I like the cat one. I like the kitty one. I like the white cat. The cat's fun. I really do. I like the kitty. She's cool. But the thing is, the kitty is like, oh, well, you know, it's a cat, right? We'd like to add a little rusty cat to this, too. Speaking of cat, he's outside. I gotta let him in. Uh, anyway. Uh, so, anyway, guys. So, this is the idea you could do with the software. I think it's kind of cool. It's still an experimental thing. But uh, I did start working with it with the other computer uh, originally. And so, I installed it on Steam on this computer so I could see if I could do something with it. Since this computer certainly has the capability of doing it. And so it works. That was the whole point. Is it works. I can do things with this. You know. But for now. Um, that's enough of this little tutorial. I don't really have much more to show right now. But I thought I would show it to you. So stay out of trouble guys. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.